beta beta by alpha into epsilon so that is what here plus write this epsilon is that clear now the next line what since alpha is greater than beta you are having the here also you are having alpha is greater than beta right alpha is greater than beta when you find beta by alpha that will be less than one when alpha large alpha is large then beta by alpha will be very small so therefore rhs of this equation will be tends to zero rhs will be tends to zero okay because of that reason so here you will get m star of e equal to zero you are substituting in the place of e you are putting e alpha comma beta is equal to zero you know that e alpha comma beta is a so that is why m star of a is equal to zero finally you proved f is differentiable almost everywhere